Hello world, this is Dennis, and this is a video I've been wanting to do for a couple days now. And it's uh, showing off what my new antenna setup can do. So I've got the ICOM ICR75 up and running, and we'll be tuning through the bands a little bit, just to get you an idea of what the antenna can do. Um, right now I have it on, um, uh, let's see here, trying to remember, I think it's the... 15 meter ham band, which was I was list that was the last band that was listening to the other days, so um, not going to hear anything at this time of night. Uh, uh, it's uh, 119 UTC, so we'll go down to my uh, favorite frequency on 75 meters, and uh, hopefully that group of hams I like to listen to are on right now. So let's turn this up. That was 3850 kilohertz, my uh, favorite frequency to listen to the hams that uh, night. Now let's uh, choose a band. Um, let's see here, put this on AM mode. And let's go down to 4.7 megahertz. WWCR on 4840 kilohertz. The band is just a little bit noisy with the TV on in the next room, but um, this is not as bad as what it used to be. This is uh, a lot better. Here's something different, 4875 kilohertz. Let me uh, look it up real quick. Hopefully, my arm doesn't end up in the video. Let's check it real quick. Okay, it's from South America. Radio Diffusoria Roar Ama, I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not 100% sure. But, um, the. Okay, it looks like it's in Brazil. Yep, Brazil. Now, this is what I was getting the one night. Um, I didn't film it, but I was getting a lot of African and uh, South American stations that I've never heard before.
It's a little hard to hear. Let me try turning on the preamp. And that cape didn't help that much. WCR and 5 megahertz. Twenty-five kilohertz, which is looking it up, looking it up, looking it up. Uh, let's see here. Okay, looks like it's from Cuba. Radio Re Rebelde, I think that's how you pronounce it. Not hundred percent sure. I'm bad for pronouncing these uh, foreign station names. <laughs> Radio Havana, Cuba on 5040 kilohertz. Uh, 5110 kilohertz, so let's uh, shoot up to 5.8 megahertz. Oh, forgot to bring that back up. Okay, there we go. Just quick scan through, you know, each band just to give you an idea what the sound noise level sounds like. This is up at uh, six megahertz, uh, six point eight one zero, seven point eight one zero, a little bit noisier, eight point eight one zero, nine point eight one zero. 10 10.810 11.810 12.81 13.81 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 let's just go with that 2 megahertz a little bit noisy, but not too bad. Four minutes. Four minutes universal time. Radio New Zealand on fifteen point seven two zero. Not too good tonight, so let's try Radio Australia on 17840. About the same. Quick go through 9 megahertz. Uh, 
that's a loud one. Uh, that's uh, 9.265, it's a religious station. Let me look it up real here. quick here. I think that is, okay, W-I-N-B, out of, um, I know it's on the East Coast, um, looking it up real quick, waiting for the map to load, okay, that is in, okay, Pennsylvania. Okay, our message for... All of our new listeners and invite you to return every weekday. WRMI on 9395 kHz. -E Download the True News app onto your smartphone or mobile device. Reports in Washington say the Obama administration plans to punish China over alleged computer hacking. Obama administration. Yeah, Greece isn't coming in too well tonight. I think this should be WTWW on uh, 9475. Overall, in my opinion, um, from what I've uh, heard so far, um, just in the last couple of days when I have had some chances to tune around a little bit, I'm liking the performance of this antenna setup so far. Although for some reason, and I don't know why, I've got this bug up my butt that I want to, you know, run the antenna out to the tree. I don't know why, because this setup seems to be working extremely well, but for some reason I want to go out to the tree, and I don't know why, because I keep telling myself that, you know, this is the best setup, but I don't know. Maybe one day I might you know, give it a try, or maybe just for heck of it, maybe I'll set up a second antenna and um, get a switcher where I can switch between, you know, two antennas, just to compare, you know, how they work out. Maybe that's something I'll do in the future, but uh, anyhow, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, peace and all that good stuff.